Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Lakota East High School in the Hawks Nest tonight. The Lakota East Thunderhawks host the Hamilton Big Blue. I'm Dave Evans with my broadcasting partner, Mike Goldman. And, Mike, tonight the, uh, the stats might be a little bit misleading in terms of what the standings are showing because Lakota East is second at 7-2. Uh, and two. Hamilton's showing 0-9, oh but the record for Hamilton is misleading because of recent, uh, let's say, uh, administrative issues. They've had a number of forfeits, but this is a solid ball team. Very, very solid, very solid basketball team with good, good scores from uh, Lewis, who's one of their top, is the top scorer, Jackson Lewis. Sage Torrentino and Bri uh, Brian Ishmael, great athletes. Play the two uh, Tolentino and Ishmael play great uh, football. Great football players. So great athletes out there. So, you know, like any GMC game, I don't care what the record is. They're gonna it's like they East beat Sycamore pretty handily the other day. And guess what? Sycamore turned around and beat West the other day. Yep. So exactly. So anything can happen in the GMC, and uh, it's ready to go. So. Well, Jackson Lewis is the uh, engine that makes the car go for uh, for Hamilton, and he is leading the team in almost 16 points a game, one of the top scorers in the uh, the GMC. Nate Johnson, the big motor for Lakota East. Again, he's over 16 points a game, GMC Player of the Year last year in the uh, in the conference. And overall, it's going to be a, uh, a situation where, again, rebounding is probably going to make a huge difference in the outcome. Yeah, well, I think what's happened here uh, a little bit, uh, you know, how the East team has evolved. Uh, Nate is obviously the leader, but uh, Jack Cronegy, I'll call him Crony, has had three great games in double figures, four, actually four in a row. And then uh, Charlie Kendrick has come off injured after being injured for most of the season. And he's kind of the heart and soul in the middle, giving him that physical in the middle where they can get some rebounds. Although I think the rebounding has been improving quite a bit. So if you ask Clint, they're improving and evolving every game, so to speak. No and doubt about it. And, and, and it's kind of, it was uh, Nate and um, and Colsey doing some a lot of work. Now they, they all have a little bit of help and a little bit more balanced scoring as well. Yeah, uh, Jack Cronaghi, uh, as you call him, Croner. Uh, Crony, I call him Crony. Crony, he has really, really developed into a, a big weapon. And he's only a sophomore, which is amazing. Second in the team in scoring and emerging as one of the uh, young shining stars here in the GMC. Yeah, he's earned a, he's earned a starting spot. And, uh, yeah, he's double figures. He's had games of 23, 16. So he's, he's definitely coming to the table. What's really probably going on, uh, since we can't go to a lot of the games, but uh, it's taken a lot of pressure off of Nate. And it's making the defense having to play more spread out on him. And that's why you see more balanced scoring and seeing some pretty good victories coming through, too. So, so the uh, the opening lineups, we, we want to run through those real quick? Yes, yeah, here we go. So for the big blue, we got Jackson Lewis, number zero. He's a senior, 5'11 guard. Marshall Quincy Sims, a guard, number one, 6'3, senior. Tori Jett, number two, 5'11, senior guard. And Brian Ishmael, 6'4", sophomore. 6'4", sophomore. And a uh, heck of a football player will be starting. For East, you got Poppy, number four. Jaden Coles, number five. 23 for Crony. Peck, 24. And Nate the Skate Johnson starting out, our senior guard. Everybody else is juniors. Opening tap controlled by East as they put their offense in motion here. Hamilton... Playing it in a two. Play. It looks like a 2-3 to me. What do you think? Looks like a 2-3 right now. They're 2-3 matchup. Yep. Or 1-2-2. Two, two. We'll see what yeah. the spacing looks like here yeah. in a few moments. It's long skip pass. Cross court. Kick back up. Great ball movement by the Hawks. Crony. Count it. Downtown. That's what a nice move. That was Poppy. Oh, that was Poppy. Nice move. My bad. East the, the on the board. The popster. East on the board first, 3-0. That was a really good play. Uh, Poppy started on on the uh, far side of the of the baseline and came on over. It was a good good play. Ball knocked out of bounds. Hamilton maintains possession. Good opening start for East on offense. Very patient. East in their usual man-to-man. -man. Hamilton with an overall nice, nice size ball club. Good, good physicality, and uh, matches up well with East. Yeah, uh, number four, uh, he is a seven footer. They said. Ishmael. He gets Ooh. hammered on the spin move, and Ishmael heads to the line for a pair. First team foul on Lakota East. That's on Nate the skate. Yeah. We, 
that's something that we want to avoid. Yep. Nate is the uh, the centerpiece around the, uh, the Lakota East team. Ishmael is a 63%, I take that back, 52% free throw shooter. And counter. Yeah, 6'4 sophomore. He's uh, he's going to grow into that body, and boy, by the time he's a senior, he'll, he'll be. They say he's got a good chance athlete. at Division One football so far. Is yeah. that right? Yeah. A little bit of backcourt pressure here. Makes them both. Got to get it over. East close to the 10 second violation. Yeah. I, like, I like the defense they're playing. Very aggressive. Little matchup, stay on top of it. There's Crony. Nice jump stop. Good defense. Crony with a jumper, baseline, off the mark, rebound control by Hamilton, big blue. It's number one, uh, Quincy Sims Marshall looking to run, layup. Count it. By Ishmael, and Hamilton takes their first lead of the night, 4-3, at the six minute mark. Stolen away from Johnson, Hamilton with a two on one break. Good Johnson defense. gets back on defense. Finish it. Crony. Or that's, yeah, Crony ahead of it, misses the layup. Rebound controlled by Hamilton. Up and Jack down. It's like a game, like a hockey game. <laughs> nice move. Nice move. N nice layup right-handed off the glass by number three, Kareem Swain. Up 6-3. I like the Hamilton's defense. I mean, they're definitely throwing the uh, East off a little bit off the norm. Johnson gets bodied. Good defense. Poppy feels it. Oh, in, in and, and, and out. out. In yeah. and out. Yeah. Good rebound by the big man. Actually, that's uh, Sims. Great rebound. Great strong rebound. This fight tonight on the glass is going to be huge. And this time, Breon Ishmael leans in, kisses the glass Eight with three. that shot. 8-3, Hamilton with a five-point lead. This uh, matchup zone or whatever they're doing is really uh, taking it to East so far. They'll adapt. Johnson thinks about the three. 15-foot oh. jumper off the mark. Hamilton looking to run. Ishmael out front. Pressure by Crony off the glass. Great defense by Crony. Johnson looking to run back. In the glass, Euro step. Nice dish. Great finish by assist. Jaden Coles. To Nate the skate. Man, we got a run and gun going here now. Shot short, out of bounds, off Hamilton. Well, Ishmael short armed that layup. Going up and down, aren't they? Charlie Kendridge coming in now for East, taking, uh, getting Nate the skate out, taking a break. Kobe Peck bringing the ball up. Hamilton's game plan clearly involves uh, enough pressure in the uh, guard position to knock. Oh, nice block. Knock East off the rhythm. Shot blocked. Good defense. <clears throat> like we said early on, uh, Hamilton's got the athletes. Yes, they do. Oh, nice move. He's Ishmael beat. off the glass. Contact, but no foul. 10-5. Big blue by five. Just over three and a half remaining here in the first. Trying to pull the trap. You got him. You got him. Nice move by Crony. Crony. Oh, he's oh. Going. oh he changed his he mind. He changed his mind. <laughs> he, he, he called, started the call charge and then said, no, nah, that's a block. Yeah, he changed his mind. Take a look at that on the replay. I, uh, thought, he was, I thought he was there. That's a tough call. That's yeah. a tough call. I thought he was there. Ishmael not happy. Yeah, I thought that was, uh, I thought it was good defense. He did cover a lot of ground coming across the key quickly. First one is good. Crony is a 94% free throw shooter. Poppy taking a break. Coach Nate in now for East. 94%, huh? Almost as good as you were in high school. Yeah, right. That was my uh, spelling. Nice. <laughs> Cronagi cashes the second one, 10-7. His first two. East down by three. Pressure on the backcourt now being applied by Thunderhawks. Oh, almost a travel by yeah. Hamilton. There's Lewis. Nice pass. Block from behind. Good hustle back. Three-point shot. Count it. 
cash by Kareem Swain. 13-7, Hawks down by six. Crony. Lewis ironically is the smallest player on the floor for Hamilton and he's their leading scorer. No, oh, count it. Wow, wow. wow. Crony for three. That was almost NBA three-point land there, Mike. Well, he brought rain there. We're supposed to get snow this weekend. 13-10. So. <laughs> Good basketball game. I'm liking this. Oh, that's a foul. Yeah. That's a foul. That's uh, Jaden Coles picks up a his, foul. His, his first. First. Second team foul on the Thunderhawks. Good up and down action so far. I do like the athleticism of Hamilton, and, and honestly, he fell. That's that's. Lewis loses his footing, controls the ball, three pointer on the way by Kareem Swain, and he catches another one. His second one of the evening, 16-10. Hamilton, Hamilton up by six again. Big Blue is hot. They're looking to run and gun. Yeah, they're doing, I guess it's kind of a matchup zone, yeah. They can control that middle with the big guy, number four. And Nate Johnson on the bench right now. He's coming out. He's coming in next time. Nice in. interior pass. Kick out. Three point on the way by Peck. A no little good. bit short. Look at Charlie. Count it. That's blue collar work in there, baby. Yes, sir. That'll get the guys going. That's the rebounding uh, physicality we're looking for. Nice play by Lewis. Wow, Lewis with, with the uh, slashing move. Kisses it off the glass. Coach Clint didn't like that defense. You can't let him skate right through there. I mean, at this sort of a pace, Mike, we're looking at a 70, 70 plus point game, 18 12. Yeah, we have the final. I think this zone has got us a little messed up. Take it, Colsey. Oh, nice, nice move by yeah, Coles. And that's it. Step back dribble and step to the right, pop oh, nice the jumper. Defense. Oh, almost a foul. Lewis looking to run. No look pass. Count it. Ishmael cashes another one. Ten Good. points in the first quarter for Breon Ishmael. 20 to 14. Big blue by six. What a great pace. Yeah. Good basketball. They're just beating us down the court right now. Give Big Blue credit. They've taken it to East so far in the first quarter. Looks like East is going to be happy to maintain last possession here. Yep. Waiting for the last shot. Hamilton Crown doing a lot of clapping. You should set the ball in motion right around the 10 second mark. Here we go. Give it to Crony. Let him take a, one of the sky, sky jobs. Jumper, skip pass. Atkins with the three. Oh, in, in and, and out. out. All right, nice. Nice shot. Good pass. Good shot. So at the end of the first quarter of action. Lakota East finds themselves down 20 to 14 here at the Hawks Nest. We'll be back in a moment with some stats and second quarter action. Hey, Cindy. Hey. Westchester wants to know, how do I apply for employment? Applications are online at www.westchesteroh.org. Uh, applicants can go there to see what positions are available. Uh, applications need to be completed, signed, and returned to Westchester Township. And that can happen one of two ways. They can mail it to 9113 Cincinnati Dayton Road, uh, Westchester, Ohio, 45069. Or the second way to submit an application is by email, which is hr at westchesteroh.org. If you have any questions, you can always call us at 513-759-7217. If you have a question for Westchester Wants to Know, visit us at our website or one of our social media pages.
So as we get ready for some second quarter action, Mike, stat sheet interesting to look at right now on the boards. Hamilton has got basically a two to one ratio uh, lead over East, seven to three in total rebounds. Shooting percentage is scorching 73% versus 42% for East. <laughs> They came out hot as firecrackers. We need to call the fire department. I'm telling you. So, yeah, great job. I give the blue credit. They came out ready to go, and they got some easy buckets. Eight, so. eight for 11 from the floor for Big Blue. Five for 12 for Lakota East. East ball. Big, uh, big Blue also oh, big two. Blue ball. My bad. Big Blue also two for two from three-point land. Hawks two for five. We got push off. We pushed off. Wow. Turn. Let's see, he said he pushed off on him. Here's the replay. Oh, I didn't, I would have let that go. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't see it there either. Ball knocked out of bounds. Yeah, he sold the call. Off blue. Yep. Very vocal bench, but coaching hard, I love it. No doubt Nate Johnson looking to get on track here and get on the scoreboard. Clinton yelling out instruction. He said override, I think. Override. Overload. Overload, okay. Get Try it out of there. Get it out of there. Trying to break it pop down. Pop it. Pop it. That's good. Count it. Nothing but nylon. The popster. 2017. Three-pointer drained by Kyle Poppy. I ran into his mom in the hallway. She said he better have a good game tonight. <laughs> oh. Good, good D. Lewis oh, down, for three. Down. Off the mark, controlled by Nate Johnson. That was a deep one. Charlie, look at Charlie going against the seventh footer. Oh, this time, off. this time Ishmael draws the foul. He was Charge called. I liked it though. He went right after him. Here we go. Nice interior pass. Tries to turn and go strong to the hoop, and this time drops his shoulder and gets called for the foul. Third team foul, again, a little bit iffy relative to the typical GMC uh, contact, Mike, but. It's all right. Maybe they're trying to do something with the game. A little, little press action by East. Both teams doing a great job moving their feet on defense. Yeah. Well. I think East has been beat to the ball a little bit uh, too much. Ishmael kick out. Much better defense this quarter so far for East. Three-pointer from the baseline, off the mark. Lewis with the putback, and he picks up a contact foul with the chance for the three-point play. That'll be on Peck, that's his first. That was great court awareness by Lewis to realize he had the uh, space to just pick that ball up in midair and push it back up. Giving Crony a Colsey back in, giving Crony a, a breather. Lewis is a 55% free throw shooter. This one too strong. Rebound controlled by Poppy. Colsey with a kiss. Wow. Nice, nice. loader. Nice, nice loader. They're running and gunning. Look out. 22 19. Got to get back. Wow. They're running. They're running. East is definitely getting beat on transition. Off, uh, he's not happy. Off, uh, off the main basket. Off the yeah. main basket. Off the defensive rebound by Blue. 24-19, big Blue by five. Oh, travel on. Is that on Poppy? That's on uh, Kendrick. Oh, Kendrick. Yep. Take a look at that on the replay. Baseline pass. Yeah, he got he got he, stuck. He, uh, he stepped on uh, stepped Ishmael's on foot. foot. Yeah. Ishmael was glad he didn't get hurt. That was a good call. Mm -hmm. Hawks looking to slow down this big blue offense. It definitely is very aggressive on offense. Ishmael. Oh, that was a push. That was a push way off the mark. You're talking he, about lowering your shoulder. Johnson looking to go. He oh, gets yeah, hit. There you go. So Nick. Nate Johnson heads to the line for two free throws. He's a 74 percenter. Third team foul on Hamilton. That was a nice defensive run. Once uh, Nate got that, he just started gliding down.
Diego Jennings getting ready to come in for Hamilton. Good. Nate Johnson catches the first. <laughs> Bobby Sager is the official talking to the big blue guys. They're all smiling it up. Trying to knock it down to a three three point deficit. And okay. No oh, oh. tipped in by Colsey. Nice put back by number five, Jaden Coles. Oh, that was nice. Very athletic move in. East now down by two, 24-22. I was afraid he was going to get over the back on that one. Look at Lewis. Lewis is quick. Man, he's got very quick feet. He is a quick player. Count it. Wow. Nice, N nice drive to the hoop and, and put back by number 22, Elijah Givens. Yep. Coles with the oh, lead underneath. It. Count it. The Spicer. Spicer with his first bucket of the ball game. Spice man. This is like a heavyweight match here, Mike. They're just going back and forth. Yeah, they are. Good basketball. If you like offense. And I know Clint, he's just ready to chomp at the bit with the defense at this point. Hawks need a couple of stops here. Generate a few possessions to get this lead back. Long three pointer. Count it. Nothing, nothing but the bottom of the well for Quincy Sims Marshall. 29 24. That's his first three of the game. Peck up and under. Uh, short. Short arms it. Hamilton looking to run. Lewis drives down the paint. Block. Colsey with the block. Nice defensive adjustment there. Take a look at that on the replay as yeah. Lewis turns the corner here, eyes up the situation, and drives hard down the middle of the key, and Colsey comes across and Good just move. says, not in my neighborhood. Good move by Lewis and a great play by Colsey. Colsey stepping up, man. He's got eight points. A block, a couple rebounds, I like it. Great effort by, by Jaden. Oh, Three-pointer by Lewis, all by himself. Boom, off the mark, controlled by East. Johnson with the spin move. Slow down. Jaden Cole, skip pass. Peck with the three-pointer. Count it. Count it, baby. Downtown the Peckster. 29-27. Hawks down by two. Good to see Colsey playing well. Hawks having a hard time slowing down this Hamilton offense. This time, rebound they had a miss controlled by Poppy. <laughs> Oops. Well, I'll tell you what, this Lewis kid is fast. Nate Johnson, 12-footer, okay. off the mark. Get back, get back. Oh, nice stop. Interior pass to Oh, he gets hit on the arm, gets away, and he's going to throw it down. Yeah. Defensive breakdown there by East. That's the first thir time. 31. First. Sorry. That's the first time I've seen a timeout by Clint in the first half in a long time. Yeah, that's not going to happen very often, is it? But Hawks down by four here, 31 27, and Coach Atkins. Doesn't like what he sees here on the defensive side of the, uh, the ball game. Yeah, I think uh, Nate there tried to go for the steal, miss it. And to his credit, he didn't want to get in foul trouble. So it was a, I'll take the two and keep him in the game. Right now, uh, Ishmael, uh, Breon Ishmael for Hamilton Big Blue, 12 points, leading all scorers. He's had a big night. They're shooting over, still over 70-some percent. I bet you they're close to 80 now. They're, they're playing really well. They're shooting really well. Well, we'll see what kind of adjustments the Thunder. I think it was Fox. really a pep talk on defense. Yeah. Uh, I think their offense is running pretty smooth. Yeah. And Clint, Clint, Clint and Nate are having a little bit of a coach's player discussion. Not happy with the, Nate's, the Nathan Skater. I wouldn't say not happy. He says, he, I, I know you can do better. Backward pressure easily broken by Lakota East. Up and under. Nice. Spicer with a nice. Colsey with the assist. Great pass. N nice reverse layup. 31-29. Good to see Colsey playing well. That was a great, great pass. The big guy. Brian Ishmael trying to work his way into the paint. Oop, he had him. Good defense. Oh, 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 oh. late call, late whistle. But Poppy gets called for the contact. Take a look at that on replay. 
on the skip pass by Ishmael, and then as he rolls to the paint, re-entry yeah, pass. Yeah, that's a good call. He yeah. reached. Yeah, he got bumped. That was a reach. Now you got to like the defensive intensity, but right now, East with five team fouls. Hamilton Big Blue with three. Oops. Loose ball, tipped, controlled. Lewis with the runner. Off the mark, controlled by Spicer. Peck looking to run. Take Kr it. Kronagi for three. Off the mark. Battle for the rebound, controlled by Ishmael. That's a good take. I take that shot. I don't think Jackson Lewis uh, has, has uh, got four points. Uh, a shot in the repertoire that he doesn't like. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's, he's a he's solid ball player. Yeah, he's solid. Great, I'm telling you, good athletes on that blue. Well coached. Kick out, oh, three point shot too. on the mark. You Number can't leave him open, he's hot. Quincy Sims Marshall with his third three pointer of the ball game. No, I'm sorry, that's the second. Six points. Oh, he was over and back. That was almost the walk. Peck. Count it. Finishes it with a nice, nice move down the paint. Three-point differential, 34-31. Last minute coming up. Poppy's going to oh, – wow, 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 wow. Poppy uh, – They're just getting beat on the defensive get, Gets beat spot. on the defensive end. Yeah, as I was going to say, uh, Torrey Jett with his second bucket of the ball game. They're getting too many easy buckets, I think. Let's see if East holds for the last shot of the half. 36-31, 40 seconds remaining. Looks like they will. Interesting strategy, but I guess they'll regroup at the well, uh, at the halftime break all, here and, and was, adjust the defense. It wasn't their. It hasn't been their best half of defense, uh, and their offense has been good. And Nate's got one foul on the bench. Probably a good one to just take a time. You know, let's get let's go to the locker room with no worse than we are right now. Hamilton looking to trap at half court. Ten seconds to go. Peck with a hard drive, pull up, dump underneath the Poppy. He gets Got hit. It. Kyle Poppy cashes the layup, 36-33. And that's going to be it for the first half action here. And as we look at the scoreboard, 36-33. East down by three. And time to go to the uh, locker room, make some halftime adjustments, Mike. And we'll be back with some stats and second half action in just a moment. Hey, Ryan. Hey, how you doing? Westchester wants to know, when will my street be plowed? Well, here at the township, we prioritize our streets. Some of our examples of our main roads that we do first, is La Sorza Westchester Road, Westchester Road, Barrett Road, and Cox Road. From there, we do the main thoroughfares and collectors. Some of the examples of that would be Eagle Ridge, uh, Revere Run, et cetera. And from there, we work into the cul-de-sac streets. And it's a little bit easier for us in the maintenance division, if you can, to remove your car from the street in a snow event uh, for our smaller trucks to get in and clean the street properly. I say all the main roads are not usually the township's responsibility. We also have different municipalities, ODOT to do some main thoroughfares and highways, and also the county engineer's office but we do our best what we can to get the streets clean properly. If you have a question for Westchester wants to know, you can visit our website or social media. Well, welcome back everyone. And as we start the second half action here in the Hawks Nest tonight, it's 36-33, Hamilton over Lakota East at the break. And Mike, stat sheet, almost a dead heat. Scoreboard, almost a dead heat. Great basketball. Uh, Hamilton shooting 60%, East 56. Um, midway through that quarter, I would have thought they were at 80, but East will have the ball coming out. Uh, noticeable that Nate, Nate's out there, good to see. And uh, just got to play better defense. Yeah, as you and I were commenting it during the half, Clint was steam going into the locker room and coming out of the locker room. Yeah, 36 points and a half. Very rare you'll see a Lakota East Thunderhawks team. I can't remember that big a score. Yeah, give, give up that many points. 
Good cutoff, good defense there by Alcantara. Nice ball rotation. Peck. Fast, well, that's Jaden Coles with a three. Buries it. East. Oh, they give him a two? No, they give him a three. 36 all. He, he, that's his 11th point. He's had a very good game. Very balanced. Very very impressed with Colsey so far tonight. That was a great release on that three. Yeah. Lewis, again, incredibly quick feet. Crossover dribble, kick out. Three-pointer on the way. Count it. That's uh, number three, Kareem Swain. I think that's his third three-pointer of the game. That's his 11th point. Hamilton did a good job of rattling the East offense a little bit in the first half with that pressure. Got the uh, attempt to uh, trap at the half court, Mike, but matchup zone and we'll see what happens. Zone press. Yep. Got to get Nate the skate going here a little bit. Johnson with nice he move. hesitation, passes deflected off the glass, controlled by Hamilton. Lewis looking to run, pressure from behind, ball knocked away. Johnson picks it up. Ah, uh, he steps on the sideline. Nice, nice, nice effort, effort by Nate Johnson. That was one maybe he just should have picked it up and take possession. Lewis to inbound for Hamilton. He's got to play a little D. Nice defense by Nate. Way to cut him off. Kobe got to stay with him. He's quick as a cat. Good defense. Trap on Ishmael. Down in the post. He forces it up. Off uh, the glass. Rebounded by Bobby Tory Jett. Bad timing. Long three. Too strong. That was by Quincy Sims Marshall. Hit a few of those in the first half, Mike. Yeah. And they got the offensive rebound, too. Just which seemed to be a step behind. That's almost a... That's a second foul on Nate. First foul of the half for East. Hawks trying to cr create a little bit of chaos with the heavy defensive pressure there along Ooh. the key, but Johnson gets picked up with a call for the foul. Nice move. Good Re rebound. Rebound Coles. by Coles. Looking to run. Peck, turn around, Count it. soft hook, shot, falls. 39-38, Hamilton by one. Colsey having a very, very good game, all-around game tonight. Peck with his seventh point of the game. See the Hawks are much better on defense. Yeah, picking up the defensive intensity, get, getting in the, in the personal space of the, uh, the Hamilton player. Nobody's getting a free pass on their moves. There he is again. Count it. Oh, short. This one's short. Oh, free rebound. Pick back up, and that's uh, Tori Jett with the put back. Kind of a, a sloppy rebound, but it counts. Well, that was almost a sloppy pass. That was a very risky pass. <laughs> He's down three. They've been down since the first bucket of the game they've been down the of the whole game yeah they tied it up just a moment ago 36 and immediately Hamilton answered with a three-pointer Johnson saw the glass nice entry pass by Jack Cronaghi Crony so this heavyweight fight continues here 41 40 Ishmael gets away with a push off count it no, timeout time timeout called by Hamilton Hamilton Maybe make a defensive change up here. Who knows? 43-40, but Mike uh, Hamilton's still sort of finding their rhythm. They're they're doing. They're finding right. the open man, and the open man's taking the shot, and he's making it. I mean, it's you know they're, they're good defense by East, but then they they go to help, leave a guy open, which is they they want certain guys to shoot, and they're they're making it. So uh, to their credit, I mean, uh, you know, the big blue Ishmael's got 14 points. Uh, you got uh, Swain with 11 points. So, and then their top scorer, Lewis, has only, um, what does Lewis have? Zero. He has uh, four points. So, they're passing around and working it. Yeah, right now, Nate Johnson struggling a bit. Only three points for the ball game. I'm not worried about that. I think he's going to come through here right now. Nate to skate. You gotta get, when he gets that first foul, he gets a little timid. He just got to get to the fourth quarter with less than three fouls. Doing a little... Little pressure. They're going to pressure the ball. 
Yeah, get it over. They're going to pressure it up. They backed out of it. Looked like they were going to do a zone press there. Yeah, right now we can say that the zone uh, defense that Hamilton's put out there tonight has uh, been pretty effective. Kendrick's in for East as well as uh, Coach Nate. Nice. I like the shot, though. Yeah. Kendrick with a shot off the glass, a little too strong. Ishmael back in the paint. Kick oh, up. nice steal. Colsey, there Kick he is again. Colsey, 2 on one fast break. Colsey up, off the glass. Count it. Colsey with his 13th point of the game. Best game of the year I've seen Colsey play so far. Great anticipation on that steal. Good patience, too. Oh, there's Lewis with the crossover oh, the ball the game tipped up. away by Kenrich. Ishmael in the paint. Hard off the glass. Rebound by Jet. On Short. the way, three-pointer, and this one. Wow. Shooters roll by number three, Kareem Swain. Wow. That hurts. 46-42. Another group. offensive rebound. That three-pointer went straight up, Mike, off the rim and fell right back yeah. through. So far, that's, just, that's their, been going well for them in the shooting department. Oh, take it, Nate. Atkins thought about it, setting his feet. They're daring him to shoot. Yeah, he's looking a little tentative here on offense for the moment. Need an entry pass to break the defense down. There it is, Kenrich with the soft jumper. Nice. Big man cashes it, nice soft touch. That's his fourth point of the game. He's down two. The way this is playing out, I think this could go down to the last possession. This nice. Time. Another another Grace Inlet pass. That's number two, Torrey Jett with another bucket. <laughs> His eighth point of the ball game. I keep looking over to Clint. It's an Advil night for sure so far. <laughs> Big blue up by four here. Just over two minutes remaining in the third. Hamilton now with two scores. 14 points apiece. I'll take that, Pecky. Yeah, Peck, uh, no good. Way off the mark. Yeah, Rebound. No. Air ball controlled by Hamilton. Look at the run. Way to get back. That's good defense. Lewis tied up up top Ooh. by Peck. Oh, gets away with the travel. And that's uh, number one, Quincy Sims Marshall. Nice layup. Hamilton extending their lead to six. This shot off the mark by Kenrich. Whoops, goes going down. There, Nate goes down. Rebound. Oh, boy. Tipped off by Lewis. Oh, we're just getting beat. Three-pointer by Kareem Swain. Just getting beat to the ball. All of a sudden, Big Blue pushes out to a seven-point lead, their largest lead of the ball game. Nate Johnson now with the runner. Battle for the rebound controlled by Hamilton. Quick 11, down 11 like that. What's that? We're down, are we, what am I doing? I'm no, we're down nine. Nine, I'm sorry. No. Yeah, okay, we're down nine, my 50, bad. 53-44. I can't add. Well, Hamilton's feeling it now. Mm. Really putting the pressure on the Hawks. Looks like they're going to hold for the last shot. I mean, Hamilton is just beating them to the ball on the offensive rebounds. I think they've, uh, offensive points off rebounds have been, Tremendous here for them. Hawks are going to be put in that unenviable position going into the final quarter of play with a uh, nine-point or greater deficit. Lewis with the drive. He gets bumped and foul cold on Coles. Second team foul. He got him a little bit. 11.1. Ticks remaining on the scoreboard. Ooh, Nate almost had that one. He's going to take it. He feels it. Three-pointer on the way. Short. Rebound by East. Long shot by Johnson off the mark. And as we wrap up third quarter action, Lakota East finds himself down 53-44. We'll be back with the final quarter of action in just a moment. Wow. 
I'm Carol Lucio with Butler County Safe Communities, where our goal is to reduce traffic-related crashes, injuries, and fatalities. One of the most important things you can do behind the wheel is actually before you get in your car. Make sure that you clear your car of all snow and ice. Use a good scraper, brush, and remove all snow and ice from your car. The complete windshield needs to be used in order to be completely safe. Some other things to make sure you do is to make sure you have good working windshield wipers. So check your windshield wipers, get new ones if need be. You also want to make sure that you have good fluid to clear your windshield and fluid that can be used for negative temperatures is always best. One of the most important things you can do though is check the pressure in your tires. You can have a great gadget like this or use a simple penny. If you can see Lincoln's head, you need new tires. Check your tires often as they can go down in cold weather. Another thing you can do to make sure you're best prepared is to have an emergency kit in your car. Simple things like gloves, mittens, hats, earmuffs, and warmers, hand and toe warmers, a bag of sand in case you need traction are all good things to help you make sure that you stay safe and arrive home safely. Well, as we get ready for the fourth quarter of action here with East Down 53-44, Mike, the stat sheet tells us that the Hawks got dominated on the boards, down by 21 to 12 for the ball game now on the glass. Yeah, they have eight. Uh, but first of all, it's 21-12 total, eight offensive rebounds versus two for East. And in that quarter, that I think they must have four or five of those uh, those offensive rebounds that they went into points. Both teams shooting about 56% from the field, but Hamilton dropping in seven to 12 from three point land. And there was a tied up and East gets the ball. That helps. Nate Johnson still looking to get on track here, held the three points tonight. Fifth leading scorer in the GMC, just under 17 a game. They're playing good defense on Nate. Yes they are. The zone defense is, has been uh, effective yeah. so far tonight. Yep. Honestly, it's uh, well coached. They, but you know, East is scoring, but you know, eight in travel. Block called on Hamilton on the baseline. That's uh, number one, Quincy Sims Marshall. First team foul for Hamilton. Let's see if we can get an inbound easy bucket here. Hamilton's got an impressive squad, Mike. They played very well together tonight. Yeah, excellent. Good, well coached. I'm very impressed. Finish Johnson. It. Oh, short off the glass. You'd like to have that one back. Yeah. Pressure in the backcourt. Good deep. Good, good, good guard play. Lewis looking to draw contact. And, oh, blocked from behind by Peck. Takes the rebound. Ah. Stolen back by Hamilton. Ishmael with the layup and draws the contact. Head to the line for a three-point play. Hawks down by 11, 55-44. Yep. Take a look at that on the replay. Just Peck, he got uh, dribbled right into a crowd, and he just should have grabbed the rebound and finished it. Yeah, that, they, they deserve it. Nice no-look pass by Tory Jed on the dump to Ishmael. Ishmael cashes. Young man with the three or the uh, free throw off the mark. Hawks now down double digits, 55-44. Underneath the peck, hey. high off the glass. Get it, Ken Charlie. Kenrich, left hand. Oh man, they can't buy one. Wow. Hamilton looking to run. Oh, they got it. they got numbers. Thought about the three stolen. Oh, Nobody good back try. there. Nice try. Good effort. 
Here comes Spicer back in. Probably going to start seeing more pressure. Yeah, you're lining up right now. Mike, going to put pressure on in the backcourt. Yeah, we have to. We got to do some pressure. Got to change. You got to change the mojo a little bit. Right now, they own the mojo. Lewis splits the defense. Interior pass. Count it. Hamilton cashes. I think that was number one. Quincy Sims Marshall with his ninth and tenth points of the ball game. Johnson with the jumper. Oh boy, we're just we're out of sync. Lewis at the crossover, dump underneath, oh, and we'll take that. through the legs of 22, Elijah Givens. Well, East has got to settle down. There's a lot of time left in the game. He, uh, Clint has four timeouts in his pocket. He's got to extend the game now. But this is a huge possession for East right now. No doubt about it, down by 13. Just about six minutes remaining here at the Hawks' nest. Interior pass to Spicer, skip pass, Peck tries to draw the Count contact, it. and Peck cashes, Ishmael draws the foul, I should say commits the foul. Take a Co look down the replay. The coach has wanted it on the floor. That was, uh, he definitely took him up, and then he was going up, and he fouled him. Come on. Pretty straightforward. Yeah, that was pretty straightforward. 57-46. Pecco uh, is... Um, a 71% free throw shooter. I don't know if we can, with the speed that they have, I don't know if we can press. Yeah, miss free throw. That hurts. Oh, off blue. No. Nope. Oh, Hamilton ball. Yep. Sags right there. Stay away from traps. Yep. I agree. Stay away from the traps. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, see, he's got, they just, they're just. Three-pointer on the way. This one too strong. Rebound fight for the back. Yeah. Over, over the back called on number one, Quincy Sims Marshall, and I think he twisted an ankle. He was, yeah, he's walking a little bit of pain. Is that Pecker? Here we go. I brought it back in quick. Fox with a chance to cut this lead, get back into single digits. Another big possession. Johnson thinks about it. Oh, I thought he traveled. Spin move. Off the mark. No, he's just not. Just not Nate's night. Oh, he, failed. he fouled him. Yeah. Yeah. Foul called on Peck. Fourth team foul committed by the Thunderhawks here in the second half. Three total for Hamilton Big Blue. Okay, he's got to have a stop. And if I, whoa! Almost. Almost. Good hustle by Crony. Crony. Oh, Nate, Nate Johnson, great anticipation. Uh oh, here we go. Crown, throw this one down. Count it. Fly Sama Jamma. And on the dunk, Hawks cut that lead to nine. 57-48. Scramble for the ball underneath, controlled by Hamilton. A lot of contact. Yep. And this time. That's Cole. Colsey. That'll be his fourth. Wow. He's uh, leading all scores for East with 13 tonight. Uh, he'll probably take a seat here for a moment. That's 15 foul on East. Charlie Kenrich back into the ball game. Jaden Coles takes a seat. Oh, boy, Nate is quick. <laughs> he knew what he wanted to do and almost pulled off the steal this one. Uh, little rainbow, Ishmael with a rebound, strong back up, and he draws the contact. Got to get, you got to, you got to get the rebound. That's another offensive rebound. Take a look at that on the uh, replay. He shot just, way off the mark, and he just walked right into it. He walked right in. Somebody didn't get him. Yeah, people busy watching the shot instead of watching the player to box out. Hey, Hamilton's taking it to him right now. 59-48. Make, make that 60-48. to 48. That was a big possession. 
Hawks got a lot of ground to make up here. Four minutes remaining here in the ball game. Take Johnson you gotta with take the three. That. Gotta have that. Count it. Big man catches it. That's eight points. Eight. Back to single digit lead. 60 to 51. A lot of time uh, left. Don't foul, don't foul. Lewis with the three. Oh, off what? the mark. Oh, push off. Ken. Well, again wow. getting beat. Wow. Ball went oh. off Ken Rich's hands out of bounds. I don't know if we have take a look at that on the replay. I here. thought I went the other way there, to be honest with you. He slipped a little bit. Nope, good call. Off the left hand. Yep, good call. Good hustle by Charlie Kenrich. Yep. Hampton now, uh, Hamilton now in the enviable position of being able to yeah, hold, they can hold, hold on for a good shot. Yep. You're going to put them, if they're going to do this, just put them to the line. Up, call a timeout. Timeout, the big blue. 60 to 51, three and a half remaining. And Mike, not looking good for the Hawks. They got to generate some possessions here and uh, make them count. You know, it's bottom line. Uh, I, they're just out quickening them to the ball. They're out hustling them tonight. Once they out, they, they're definitely a step ahead of East tonight. Not to say that East isn't hustling. They really are just a step ahead of East right now, getting the uh, getting a lot of offensive rebounds that have turned into points. Yep. And that's a, I, to me, that's the big difference in the game right now. But uh, you know what East has to do now is just come back and it's a, you know at each possession is important. Get the defense. Get a, get a score, timeout. We're going to put them to the line here shortly, so we – Clint's got to extend the game. That's the bottom line. Got to extend it out. I mean, so far, I mean, they've had uh, – Hamilton's had at the, at the quarter 21-12, and I guarantee you it's up to 25 rebounds or more at that point. Next up for East. They play uh, – Play in Newark tomorrow night. Playing at Newark tomorrow night, and then uh, Hamilton Big Blue plays Northwest at the Hamilton uh, Athletic Center. Getting those games in. So far, so good. Okay, Malumbo coming in. Going to get, going to do some. That's it. That's uh, on Big Blue. That's what you got to do. Yeah, it's very clear that the uh, Hamilton coaching staff has made it. Made it a priority that you get nothing but a high, high percentage shot. No need to force anything. And they charge. This time, number three. <laughs> that's a cream swing. Gets called for the charge. Hamilton coaches never like any fouls against them. That's for sure. And he might be right there. He moved a little bit, I thought, but. He got, he got the call. Kenridge picks picks up the call, 60 to 51. I think what you're going to see on on the substitutions, that defense offense uh, switch. Colsey back in there. Probably, got, probably got, see some activity here from outside the three point arc, Mike. Yep. I'm okay with taking a few twos and. Oh, Enjoy nice. Your pass, nice. Finish. No look nice. pass by Nate Johnson. What an assist. Yeah. Down to seven. That was sweet. Hawks now looking to generate a turnover. Ooh. Lead cut to seven, 60 to 53, 245 remaining. Pressure at half court, and we got a jump ball call. That's going to go to Hamilton. Yeah, arrow points Hamilton's way. Here comes the defense. East now cut this to a three point, or I should say three possession ball game, down by seven. Hamilton's going to make an effort here to take the air out of the ball, perhaps. Maybe not. Look at the Lewis. Way, the way He's Lewis plays. And this time he gets bumped, knocked to the floor. All right, one and one. Lewis is a 55% free throw shooter, so this is what you want to do. That's interesting. One of the top scorers in the league, only 55% from the line. Here comes that, e that, comes that defense offense switch. First one, count it. Big free throw for his confidence. Lewis only has five points in the ball game, so both he and Nate Johnson, typically the leading scorers for both clubs, 
having relatively quiet nights. I mean, I, I think Lewis controls a lot of the tempo, though. I think he's got more to it. Made them both. 62-53. Got to hit your free throws in this position. Kick out. Peck thinks about it. You got to hit that. Coles for that. three. No. This one off the mark. Battle for the rebound. Controlled by Hamilton. Throw it away. That'll be East ball. You got to go get the ball. Yep. A lot of coaches in the stands go right now. <laughs> I think it's his dad telling him, go get the ball. He's right. He should go get the ball. East now not having the luxury of taking much time here for each possession. Johnson. Yeah. Johnson's got to take over here. He Count it. Fouled on the drives. That was, that was some move. Take a look at that on replay. On the interior pass to Johnson, he just makes up his mind. I'm going to the hole. Yeah, and, look at, and he, and he, he hung up there. That was a great shot. Great balance. Huge. That's his 10 point. Here comes the defense. With this free throw, he could make it a two-possession ball game. Count and, it. And he does, 62-56. Malumba in. Spice, <coughs> Spice coming in. in. Yep. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, here they go. They're running. Hamilton with the spin move oh. off the mark. Battle for the rebound. Controlled by Malumba. Nope. Cleaned up by Hamilton Big Blue. Yeah. That was Tory Jett with the rebound. That would have been huge. Got to foul him. Foul him. Got, foul got, him. Got to put him back at the free throw line. Jenner. Foul him. Extend the game. That's Ishmael. Uh, and he cashes it. 20 points, 20 and 21 for the ball game. Nate Johnson. With the three. Count it. Count it. <laughs> Count it. 64 59. <laughs> 90 ticks left in the ball game. Well, that's what you want from your Division I going to Division I player next year. Take take the big shots here at the end. That's his 14th point of the game. And uh, we got ourselves a ball game. Less than two possession game. Yeah. I say you got to get him to the line. Let's go, man. Don't be, don't be flopping. Let's go. Yeah, on that last possession, which is one I'm sure Atkins would like to have back, uh, Ishmael ended up with a layup, and uh, we had two or three plays that should have been fouled before that shot happened. Yeah, absolutely. All right, let's go. Bottom line, if I'm Hamilton, got to get, got to get the ball in, hit my free throws. If I'm East, steal on the inbound pass, and let's uh, hopefully miss some free throws. But a big defensive stop here. So we've got uh, Johnson, Spicer, Malumba, Peck, and Coles on the floor for Lakota East. Okay, what? Nate Skates coming in with prime time. Watch the bomb. Pressure in the. Ooh, nice. Oh, nice. Nice deflection. Great hustle got, by Daniel Malumba. He's got to stay. He's got to stay there. Can't move. Set his feet. Oh. Oh, get deflection. It, get, it, get, it. get it. There's a scrum. Possession arrow. Timeout. Timeout. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Wow. They gave wow. Hamilton a timeout. There was no possession. <laughs> you can't call a timeout. <laughs> yeah. Overruled by the head ref. Jump ball. No, we're not. Uh, not going well with the with the guys. That was the right call. That was the right call. 64-59. Minute 23 remaining. Lakota East takes possession on the turnover. Big play for. Are they going to double Nate? Oh, oh Nate! Oh my goodness! What a sloppy play! Cow! Oh! Oh my goodness, Kobe Peck. It almost fell. <laughs> you talk about sloppy. Oh my God. Wow. Well, wow. That would have been huge. <laughs> Take a look at down the replay. About four or five players touch the ball. Peck finally picks it up, the loose one, rolls around and drops away, but he gets hammered. 71% free throw shooter. 
Nice point, uh, though, Mike, as he gets to put points on the board with the clock stopped. Count it. Up Down to four. He hits the free throw. We got a one possession ball game, folks. Got the defense in. Settles himself. Count it. Nice. 64 61. One possession play game. We're going to the wire. Now, now it's now East can can now that East is back in it. They got a ooh. pressure on the sideline. Timeout. He oh, got we the got timeout. timeout called That's this time. Good Hamilton made the mistake of getting on the sideline, which acts yep. just like a defender. That was good. That's where you want it. That's the best defender on the court is the sideline. Yeah. Yeah. They and called a timeout. Called a timeout. That was a good the timeout. Release. Yep. Absolutely good call. 64-61. So right now, Ishmael leading all scores with 21. All of a sudden, Nate Johnson with 14. After quiet. The Hamilton crew is a little flustered over there. Just for the moment. Yeah. Nate Johnson after three quiet quarters with 14 with a huge fourth for the uh, Thunderhawks. Yeah, number uh, number four, Ishmael has 21 points for Hamilton. He's had a great game, great game for him. And Kareem Swain with a big 17 on the scoreboard. So, hey, bottom line here, um, again, defend. I'd foul, extend the game. That's what we got to do because they're going to they're gonna want to go to the line and take uh, take your chance to see if Hamilton can handle the pressure at the end. And both teams now, well, Hawks have committed 17 fouls, Hamilton six, so both teams will be shooting the rest of the way. Yep. But right now, still it's still one and one, so let's get them. You know, let's get them to the line. They get it in, get them to the line, extend the game. Interestingly enough, Mike, th this was a 14-point lead that Hamilton had about three and a half minutes ago. Boy, it was it was that was a great run by East. Oh, somebody's hurt. Oh, I, I didn't realize that. I didn't know he was I, hurt. I, I had no idea. I, it was it was off in the corner behind the bench. Right. Oh. Now okay. they're starting the timeout. So number one, um, that's Sims. Yeah, Quincy Sims Marshall. Yeah. Hope he's the young man's all right. Yeah. Looks like he got a, kind of twisted his ankle. All right, here we go. Minute eight remaining, 64-61. Hawks down by three. Oh. Interior pressure. Backward pressure and tipped away by Malumba. And Ishmael heads to the line for a one-on-one -on -one situation. No no foul on the shot. Yeah. He's a 52%, 53% free throw shooter. It's all right. That's what you want. Now you got to get the rebound. I think they called that on the draw. Yeah, one-on-one. One-on-one. On one. Big shot for Ishmael. He's got 21 points. Count and it. Big makes, shot. Makes it a two-possession ball game just like that. Big shot. Big shot. Give credit to the young man. He, he was ready to step it up. Sets himself. Second free throw. On the way, no dribble. This Missed. one's strong. Rebound control by Nate Johnson. Hawks looking to go. Oh. oh. <laughs> Thrown away, goes past Charlie Kenrich, out of bounds. Didn't need that. All right, back in it. Get back in your defense. They got to stay still. Oh, he, was, he went out of, out of bounds. Out of bounds. Yeah, that's East Ball. Ball turned over by Hamilton. Ball goes out of bounds out on the sideline. All right, so the turnover didn't hurt him. No consequences there. So that's a break for East, 65-61. Jaden Cole's looking to inbound. Oh, Nate Johnson with a three. It was tipped. That was tipped. That, that ball's blocked. What do we got? A hold. We got a grab in the number two. Tory Jet will head to the line. So they're shooting for two. They're shooting two now. Shooting two? Is that the tenth? No, still one and one. They already put it up on the board. Okay. One on one. Hey, hey. 
So Jets going to the, the line, and he is a 27% free throw shooter, but he probably doesn't get to the line very much. So, Still a lot of time in the game. Fundamentals, got a box uh, out. No. Controlled by Johnson. 52 seconds remaining. I like this. He's you're giving him full court, doesn't want him to get him going. That's smart. Good deep. That's good coaching. Johnson looking for a pick. Krona, he gets hammered Foul, and he gets three. three. Three throws. Wow, wow. that's huge. An opportunity wow. to cut the lead to one with 40.4 remaining. Let's see that. We Lewis gotta... picks up the foul. Lewis pleading his case. Crony, a 94% free throw shooter. That is huge. I don't know if we have that on replay, but I'll tell you what, that, that, was, that was a tight call. Oh, uh, Cr Crony. That one off the mark. Still with a chance to cut this to a one possession ball game with these two free throws. Sophomore gathers himself. Free throw number two. Count it. Attaboy. That's his uh, sixth point of the game. Malumba back into the lineup for yeah, the Yeah, got the defense offense going. Jack Cronaghi, free throw number three. Moncroni put it in. Long. That one too strong. Battle for the rebound. Controlled by Hamilton. A lot of contact. That's Lewis all by himself with the layup, and yeah. he cashes it. 67-62, 30 seconds remaining. Nate Johnson with a long three. Count it. Cashes it. Wow. 67-65. Downtown. Take a look at that. Johnson crossed the half court line, sets up three point land, and boom, oh, buries it. Oh, that was huge from downtown. His 17 points a game, and that got it down to two. Wow. 26 seconds to go. So again, it comes down to free throws shooting. Hamilton will be shooting two shots on the next foul by East. To Hamilton's credit, they have hit their free throws here. And uh, East, well, Crony just missed a couple there, which is huge. But we think, bottom line, we got to uh, steal the inbound pass or foul right away and, and take your chances. Hey, a big thank you goes out to the entire Westchester Community TV crew, everybody in the truck, everybody on the cameras. Thank Th you. Thank you, thank you very much for your participation and support of the program on a Friday evening. I want to also congratulate Dave Emmerich for his 354th straight game of not being kicked out of a game. And he's in Florida tonight, so congratulations to Dave Emmerich. I'm sure he'll be watching on, uh, on the Internet, right? I will. I'll go to my grave with that one. There you go. 67-65, 26.7 remaining. Hawks looking to turn a uh, or generate a turnover. Need another possession. All right, we got the defense in. I'd say a steal here, and it's uh, East has two timeouts left. Each team has two. Get him on the side. Oh, nice move. Ooh. All right, well, oh, that's the player. That's the player you want to put at the free throw line, supposedly based on stats alone. Fifty-five percent free throw shooter Lewis. Yeah, but he's hit his. He's hit his free throws. Yeah. Well, law of averages would indicate maybe it's time for him to miss. We'll that's see. That's going to be. That's going to be it for Pecco. Pecco, uh, that's his fifth foul. So, Hawks now have time here to make a substitution. Cole's back into the lineup. Yeah, the defense is done. So, you got Colsey back in. You got Kendridge back in. Spicer. Spicer in. All right. Big free throws. He's got eight. First one on the way. Ooh. Off the mark. We got a one possession ball game no matter what happens here. I think his family's behind us here. You okay, Graham? Grandma okay? <laughs> Count it. Nice shot. Three point lead. 68 65, 25.3 remaining. Big shot. They're going to. Yeah, putting the pressure on Coles up top. Top looking at Johnson. You got to shoot. Johnson looking for a seam. Three-pointer on the way. This one's sh short. Battle for the rebound. Controlled by Lewis. And that's going to be the, the game. Clock running down, and that's that ought to game. do it, folks. Yeah, that's the game.
Hamilton, big blue, pulls off the upset, comes into the Hawks' nest, and beats Lakota East 68-65. Hats off to Hamilton, big blue. They played a great game and uh, hit their free throws at the end to, to, to count the game. Great job. So this is Dave Evans with my partner, Mike Goldman, and thank you for joining us tonight. Again, Lakota East loses 68-65 in a great matchup here at the Hawks' nest. Good night, everybody.